Welcome back to Chinstrap Chump. <laughs> Where I'm playing, I mean, this is my leisure time playthrough of Last of Us 2. First reactions, last episode was a little bit on the heavy side. Hopefully things get better. I'm hopeful that uh, the sun will keep on shining and keep on being in love and having friends and shit. I don't, I don't know what I'm talking about. Whatever. Let's just fucking keep going. I would say this episode is sponsored by Mountain Dew, but I'm all out at the moment. I already drank it. I drank it. Ah. Stay with Shimmer. Yeah. She grew her hair out a little bit too. Look at that. That shows the passage of time. Either that or she's just wearing it differently. I don't know. I like it. I think it looks good. Yes. Sweet. The Starfire Kids. Sweet. <laughs> I feel like after losing somebody that like close in your life, like it's kind of hard to go back to shit like that. Like, oh, trading cards. Sweet. Ooh, a map. Hmm. That's a good idea. I like that. It's a downtown Seattle. Shit, dude, I wonder if we get to explore this whole area or if this is just a... That'd be nice. That's interesting. That's different. I like it. I like it. It's exciting. Anything good in there? Found an old tourist map. Well, that's something. Yeah, I'd say so. Those are shipping containers. There's nothing in those, right? That's a look. Yeah, it's like shipping container type things. Yeah. Props to the environmental artists. You guys did a great job. Props to the animation team. You guys did a great job. Props to the sound design. <laughs> props to fucking everybody who worked on this game, dude. Literally props to every single fucking person. You guys did an amazing job of realizing like this game. It's incredible. Not sure if it's necessarily a game that's going to be one that you play through uh, a million times like the first one, but who knows? I, I'm still early on in the game yet, so who knows? I know. That's what scares me. A lot of this game has been kind of uh, walking simulator y, but I'm sure it'll open up. Now that we've calmed down from the last episode, <laughs> this shit was fucking crazy. <laughs> like, oh man. That was, a, that was a heavy one. Whoa, is that the QZ? There we go. Yep. Watch the high spots. Dog. Should I dismount the horse? Sure, how we get up there though. Let's have a, have a look, see, have a look around. Fedra. Yeah, that was the police force in the first game, basically. What 
do we get? Anything good? Stages of infection. Can you flip this one or no? Ay ay, that's terrifying, dude. Oh my god. Is that a fucking pamphlet that they read? Like actually, like. Wow. Yeah, probably not a pamphlet. This is probably for military purposes, but. Ignoring is fast and agile. Stage one infected usually travel in packs. Do not let them swarm you. This infected stage two uses an environment to hide and ambush victims. Will frequently flank and attack from behind. Approach with caution and check your surroundings. Completely blind, acute hearing uses echo echolocation to seek out prey. Keep your distance. Stage three infected are known for their ferocious attacks are extremely lethal. Rare but dangerous evolution of stage 3 infected, incredibly strong and capable of throwing acidic projectiles. Do not engage unless absolutely necessary. That is a terrifying picture. Can I just be honest? Like, that is the thing of nightmares. That is terrifying. Yes. No thank you. Okay. What do we got here? Patrol routes. Pops and Chris. I'm looking for <laughs> it wouldn't make any sense but like Sam and Henry it wouldn't make any sense because I don't think we were where the fuck did they meet up with him they were I can't remember but I mean it's after Bill's place right I don't know I forgot what city they were in it's outside of Boston somewhere. It wouldn't make sense for them to be here in Seattle. Plus, I don't know if they would let Sam and Henry. Like, Sam, he's too young probably to do anything, but who knows. Who the fuck knows? Holding cells. Soldiers have them in Boston, too. Bowed it. Bowed it. Nope. What you got? No, it's just a rag. Okay. Um, it's amazing how much I remember from the first game too. I don't know. It's. I mean, it's a pretty iconic game. Like I. <laughs> I saw a Facebook quiz thing the other day of like, how well do you know The Last of Us? And it's like the easiest freaking questions. Or maybe I'm just a nerd. Probably that one. I'm probably just a nerd. Whoa, dude. Can I prone underneath this? Yes, I can. Is there anything worth proning for? Probably not. <laughs> okay, I don't know. You ever know there's secrets? Secrets? Alright, let's just go into it. How about we go in it? I'm like a freaking normal person. I know I probably could have climbed in over there, but hell with it. I want to. Oh, I can get up on top, too. Get up, up on top of the other one? No, I don't think so. Let's go in, check it out, and then we'll climb up on top and see what we got. Empty drawer after empty drawer. Picked over. Duh. Ooh, another note. What's this? When you get to the gate, look for a soldier named Kieran. Tell him I sent you, then give him the kilo and he'll get you inside the wall. Good luck. Huh. Is that like a smuggling thing or something? Must be. Must be some smugglers. See a way in? Ellie, what about the roof up there? Okay, that's, I mean, I just, just climbing around. You can do it. There you go. What even are these? They look like big things of dirt. Dirt, dirt. You can do it. Hell yeah. 
Hell yeah. Dina, help me up here. Dina. Okay. That's a pretty sweet, sick rifle you got. It's got a magazine and everything. That's cool. I'll keep an eye out. Okay. Just see if you can get the gate open from the other side. Sounds right. good. I will do that. Okay. Yeah. Uh, the th so like the. God, fuck you. That would be so harrowing in real life. Like that's that's a big enough drop that you'd hurt yourself severely. These animations are so good. I'd almost like want to play this game just to look at it. <laughs> you know? <laughs> it's one of those kinds of games. Context clues. They put the scratches on the wall so that way you know. Well, that's cool. Bounced off the rail. That's neat. It's just funny, just, I don't know, to, it's not funny, but it's just like, shit, dude, like, Joel's dead already in the game. <laughs> like, wasn't expecting him to be dead so soon. Like, he barely had anything to do with the game, it's kind of fucked up. Like, one of the, like, you know, iconic characters from the game is dead in, the, like, the first two hours. Like, that's... I don't know, man. I can understand why people don't, like wouldn't like that. I get it, but... I don't know, I can get it, I get it, but it's like, again, just because you don't like something that happens in the game doesn't mean that the game is written poorly. Main gate, north, zero, east, two, scratched out or something. Interesting. 0512. What does it say? Got a big operation coming up and Isaac wants us to scavenge any remaining supplies from downtown to in that base. Yes. That's something. Okay. 0512. God, how come none of these drawers have anything in them? Always good to have safe passage. That's a generator. Yes, it is. Chong, chong, chongus. Where does this go? Into here. Hello. Okay. Big Chungus. Over here. What? Hey. Everything okay? Word up. What was that sound? I got that gate open. I gotta figure out this one now. Well, just slip through the hole. Thanks. 
just slip into the hole. Fuck. Jesus. I can't get over the environment, man. It looks so good. And they got, like, little... That's That, to me, is what makes it, too, is when you have, like, these animations even in, like, the trees. Like, it's so rudimentary and simple, but, like, it's it really, like, sells the image. Or, like, it really, like, you know, cements kind of, like, you know, the environment, I think, a little bit more. I don't know the first thing about making a game, but, like, kudos to the people who do that stuff. 0512, bitch. Do I need to power this up somehow? Is there another... <gasps> generator somewhere or something? Climb this. No. How's it going? Shut up. Don't talk to me. I'm thinking. Can I just plug it? I feel like I'm not going to have enough rope. Sure, I can throw this. There we go. Chungus. Big Chungus. There you go. I don't know why, I just like the word chungus, that's all. Lord, well, how do I get in there, dude? Dude, here we go. Enter passcode. Wait, hold on. I want to open up every other one. Hold up. Hold up. What do we got? Yes, there's main gate. 0512, 1382, 5345, 61, okay. Well, let's, let's get her in here, fuck it. Start up the generator again. I want to open the other ones up. The fuck, man. Oh, that's lame. Well, whatever. Fan. Now what? I found a note back there. Had some codes on it. It says there's a WLF safe house at some place called Seravina Base. Seravina. So we find it? Hopefully we find our first WLF. Get them to talk. Go from there. Wily little fuck. I don't know. I'm just saying dumb shit. Those gate and codes probably didn't do anything for for that. I don't know. 
There was that locked door back there. I'm not going to worry about it. It should be fucking fine. I don't, I don't want to sit here and fucking try to spend hours trying to figure it out. <laughs> and I do mean hours. Oh, shit, look. But whatever. Saravino Hotel. That's got to be it. Fuck Fedra. You know how it is. Okay. Let's find a way past this, uh, fuck Fedra gate. Very creative. Gets right to the point. Let's get closer and scope it out. Why? I found the generator. <laughs> okay. What do you want to fucking scope out? What is there to scope out? Fuck Fedra, I see it. They catch you tagging a wall like this. Beat the shit out of you. Or worse. QZs sound like fun. Oh yeah, you've never been to a QZ, have you? Bitches. Oh, I thought that was a building. Stop making noises up there. What are you doing? Fucking quit it. I'm trying to be immersed, and you are breaking my immersion. Hello. What is this? Admitted, denied, expelled. <sighs> Sergeant Ward continued a WL of disruption of our supply lines in addition to infected attacks and spore infestations. Means we are still unable to meet the weekly food distribution quotas. Keep the city safe. Keep the city gates sealed to new entrants until further notice to use the burden on the food stock. Step up your sweeps for criminals and expel them. All class two crimes now qualify for expulsion. We're running out of time. So the WLF must have been a thing. Uh, they must have been a thing even. Okay, here we go. Nope. Need some gas. Ah, it's out of gas. God damn it. I mean, that would make sense because we've got this whole other area to explore. No. What? The note mentioned that there's gas in the courthouse garage and the dome. All right. Courthouse garage and the dome. So what's the plan for finding these places? We ride around and see what we see. You think Tommy came through here? He did. I'm gonna not really so scour everything for <laughs> collectibles and shit. Wow. Pretty sure we're here. Ah, oh, nice. We'll mark it up as we go. Okay. Sweet. Well, what if we're not there? What if you were wrong? Out here? I'm guessing the military bombed the shit out of this place. Why would they do that? They would sometimes destroy parts of the city that were lost to the infected. <laughs> That's funny. That seems like overkill. Well, Isn't that funny? It usually worked on the infected or the rebels. I say it's funny that Ellie is now educating Dina on like everything that Joel told her about. You're lucky you didn't grow up in a QZ. I'm starting to get that impression. So there's obviously like a dome over there, but you know we got we got to investigate a little bit. One more asshole soldier. No way. I can't see you taking orders from anybody. Yeah. Good point. I gotta say, I was expecting the Seattle QZ to be a lot more occupied. Yeah. Maybe they're all hiding at the Serabina. How many WLF you think there are anyway? Well, at least eight. If we're lucky, that'll be it. We'll be fine. We should stay alert. Stock up while we can. This is cool. I like this. I like this. 
Well, how come I could interact with it and now I can't? The fuck, man. What the fucking fuck, man? Oh. She's just adding it to the map. I see. Okay. Good sound effects on the water, too, by the way. What? I don't understand. It's a question mark. So what do I do with it? What the fuck do I do with it? What? Okay, now? What the fuck? I wasn't doing it before. Hello, officer. Ration truck? Trying to hide, maybe? Unsuccessfully. There are bullet holes in the door. It sure looks that way. There would appear to be bullet holes, anyway. Hello? Everything is in place. We will be waiting. Oh, man. Once we intercept the convoy and take the federal officers captive, you can abandon your post and join us. I know you've taken numerous risks and lived in fear of being discovered. Your loyalty to our cause is appreciated. Isaac. Harsh bud. Harsh freaking bud, dudes. Sorry. Bye. How about this one? Is there anything in this one? This one crashed. Map location complete. Interesting. Very cool. Kudos to Naughty Dog for making these extremely large and well detailed environments. Uh, gotta give it up, man. Gotta give it up. Alrighty. Alrighty. I think Shimmer's getting sick. What? How can you tell? She sounds a little hoarse. Oh, boy. Come on, that was a good one. Shiva. Who keeps making noise? What are you doing? There's like a fucking like underground parking garage or some shit over there. I want to go in there, but I can't. Oops. Okay. Let's go the other way. This is like, uh... Shadow of the Colossus all of a sudden. Hey. What? I think I found the courthouse. What? How can you tell? Um, see that sign up there? On the building that says courthouse? <gasps> oh, well, nice work, detective. Mm -hmm. Mark this place on the map. Map location added. Hear that? I hear it. Infected. It's coming from the courthouse. This is gonna suck, isn't it? At least we're ready for him. Um. Are we tasked with going to the courthouse right this second? I mean, I kind of want to look around a little bit more. It's usually something cool to find. There's the dome. At least I can make the assumption that that's the dome anyway. Go check out that fire truck. Make this jump. The military got their ass kicked here. WLF. These guys don't fuck around. No fucking kidding. Dude! I easy jump, don't worry. Ugh. Worrying's in my blood, so. Chill out. What do you got? What do you got there? Boy. I heard another uh, room. Hey. What the was thing? She says there are supplies at some bank. I can't read it. I said we go for it. If there are enough weapons uh, in there, I know some guys who can trade for some pictures. I don't know if I'm going to get all the boxes to myself. Aaron. A. A. Ron.
Let me see. What? Okay. We did that. There's one down there. Okay. What if you didn't find the map? What would you do? Man, check this out. This thing's heroic. Fuck yeah, dude. Here we go. Take it. Why the fuck not? swing it's like some proper adventure right. shit going on in this game Must be how you get up here. See, sweet. That's cool. I like that. Where's the like button? Can I hit the like button? <laughs> this isn't like Death Stranding where I can give likes to people for building a rope. <laughs> this is the more calm, contemplative, exploratory part of the game. Let's see, where is that other... Yeah, it's on this way. Let's go check that out. Let's go check it out. I'm about to cut the episode because I, I want to try to mitigate it to being about half an hour long. But, whatever. Let's see what we got over here. Is that a thing? No, it's just rubble. Okay. There's a building over here. West Lake Bank. I think we found the bank. Fuck yeah, dude. Yes. Yes, we should. And next time on Chinstrap Chap, we will explore the bank.